We are here at one of my largest vending machine accounts. We're about to go in just under a week later and see how much cash is in these bill acceptors. I'm pretty sure they're close to being jammed. We'll go, we'll load them up. And I'm gonna give you guys some tips, some tricks, and some understanding of the vending machine business in a nuanced way so you understand it better so that you can go out and get accounts like this for yourself. I will say this, $3,000 a month vending account is not your typical vending account. There are so many vending gurus all over the internet preaching, hey, $3,000 a month, $5,000 a month. These deals are very hard to get and usually you have to pay a top dollar commission. So let's go in, check out these machines. I'll break down the cost of the machines, the cost of the product, my profit margin, and how much we actually made. Let's get right into it. As you can see, definitely being used. We'll fill up some of these products. Love these machines. Go over here. Bam, looking good. One row out, we'll fill it up. Let's test it out with a little bit of Apple Pay. Select the product. All right, so something's definitely going on with 150. Okay. Check that out. Open her up. One thing, sometimes chips open, so you have to have like a little vacuum, kind of vacuum this stuff up. I know why you're here. Watch this, guys. <laughs> insane. That is insane. Guess how many bills in the comments, but let me get to work here. Figure out what this issue is, and I'll get back to you guys. 20 minutes later. I figured out this issue, and I need to explain it. You see it says $1.25, 158 Let me show you how much it actually costs. No one was able to buy it. Can you see that? I had marked it incorrectly. Basically, it was $251 for Reese's. All we gotta do is zero this out, and then bam, done. So now let me just change this. And I love scrollers. If you don't have these, you're gonna wanna get them. They scroll, it makes the prices a lot easier to change. Problem fixed. Now I gotta grab some Ritz Bites out of the car. Insane that it had this much cash in it. Trying to be a YouTuber is tough, but here we go. So I'm gonna just fill up the Ritz Bits. They devoured these, and then we'll head over to the drink machine and get that loaded up with what we have. But this was a service call, and a service call is something you need to be aware of in the vending machine industry. It basically just means that you're being called to take care of something with your machine. So just always be aware that that is something that can happen. We'll do a quick collection, so here we go. Wow, that's got some weight to it. This is probably my best collection video I've ever done. As you can see, I don't even know if I can get this out. Should be able to. We gotta open up both sides sometimes. Put some tens in there. Definitely a nice fat amount. Now we'll collect from the drink machine. And I can only imagine how packed this is. But here we go. Show you guys what you want to see. Wow, this is heavy. These results aren't typical. Let me go ahead, get to work, stock the machine up, and we'll talk a little bit more about the vending business and how you can get started the easiest way possible. A few inches later. We're all filled up. Got a new selection for some water. So we add that in. Let's show you guys the good stuff. And this is heavy, guys. You need to definitely feel a bill acceptor this heavy once in your life for sure. Always make sure your change is full. I'll have to bring back some change, but if this isn't full, your machine won't accept this. So no bills means empty bill acceptor. Incredible, incredible guesses, totals. Subscribe, like, comment. Biggest collection you've ever seen. Here we go. I think all I could say is holy smokes. This location in the summer is going to probably do about 30% more, which I think is actually insane because the numbers it's already doing. Think about this, guys. Those collections weren't even a month. They weren't even a month. It was barely two weeks. But man, I think we have a winner here. And I kind of want to show you guys how much we made. So we'll go back to the house we'll strap all the bills we'll see how much we did and you might actually be surprised at how much of this money is take home here we go bear with me as i drive home so we got our money, we have the build counter set up, we have the GoPro set up. I just wanted to show you guys how well this did. So look at this, I'll have to even separate it. There was a little bit of change. I didn't show you guys really the change, but look at this. This was the drink machine and this was the snack. For whatever reason, they seem to be using card more on the drink machine versus the snack. I don't know why they use card more on the drink machine than they do the snack machine. Regardless, it was a great collection. I was there on a service call, so it wasn't necessarily a full fill but i wanted to fill it up pop it off great account one of my newest and i'm very excited to show you guys how much it did so let's hop right into this all right so here we go this collection is actually nuts definitely one of my best collections
and we did really well at this location as you can see from the GoPro clips. I didn't necessarily count it all, but it looks like we're just under $500 in cash and I still believe there was probably another 400 or 500 in credit card sales. This collection was just under two weeks and to see this amount of bills for two weeks is insane because everyone has been switching to credit card lately. If I could leave you with two tips so that you could have fat stacks of cash like this is to focus on your location specifically. Don't worry about everything else. Don't worry about your product. Don't worry about what you're going to say. Just focus on location, getting the best locations you can. And then if I was to leave you with another thing is just be a good vending machine operator. Be good at what you do. Do not just place a machine and think you're going to get rich overnight and think that like these stacks of cash are actually fully profit because realistically, I don't know what I'm going to title this video, but this isn't all profit. If at all, any profit, I put over $11,000 worth of equipment at this location. So the fact that it's going to do 2,000, 2,500 every single month, that machine will be paid off in the next eight months or so and the product inside with a nice, nice profit margin. So it really depends on you how much money you have to invest. I know a lot of people like to bootstrap it, start used, start cheap, start small. I've been there, I've done it. And now is the time where business starts to kind of scale. We get the bigger accounts because we're well known in our area. And that's why we're here today doing this collection video. I don't do this to brag. I don't do this to blow. I am doing this to inspire the next generation of vending business owners that are out there, the young ones, the old ones, the in-between, whatever it is, get out there, get your first vending account, make some extra money, pay an extra bill, save the money, invest it, do what you want to do, whatever's going to make your life happy. With all this crazy news going on, we never really know what's going to happen. So start while you can. I'm excited if you guys made it to the end. If you did make it to the end, just comment. You're the best Dom. No, comment whatever you want, but definitely comment something because I really appreciate everyone who comments down below. It really helps this channel grow more than you know. And obviously it's free. It takes about five seconds to write a simple comment. So look forward to your comments, look forward to your likes, look forward to your subscriptions. Tune back in on this channel every single week for new videos. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. 328. AM. I did just finish calculating the amount and I said I was going to do a total. So this was $552 for just under two weeks, guys. And that is just cash. It is unbelievable how much this made. If the credit card sales are sent over to the editor yet again, you will see it on the screen here. What an amazing collection, as you guys can see. Bam.